I'd like to show you our uh, multi-gas family of instruments called the XAM. We make the XAM 2000 and the XAM 5000. They look almost identical. What designates them apart is the XAM 2000 has the black grill, the XAM 5000 has the silver or gray grill. Uh, the 2000 can be a 1, 2, 3, or 4 gas instrument. The uh, sensors available for it would be the combustible uh, sensor, the oxygen sensor, the carbon monoxide sensor, and the hydrogen sulfide sensor. Available on it is a standard alkaline battery pack, or you can upgrade to the nickel metal hydride, which is a rechargeable battery pack. We also have the heavy duty uh, alligator clip to clip it onto your uh, person. And we also have the D-ring that you can put a lanyard on and hang it around your neck. The approvals on this, uh, intrinsically safe, uh, go all the way up to class G, which is your combustible dusts. And this unit is also watertight, it can be submerged. Um, the unit has four alarms. You can uh, see the, the, the visual alarms, the LEDs blink, the uh, screen blinks, whichever gas is an alarm, the uh, unit vibrates, and of course you will hear the uh, beep, the sound from the beep there. To turn it on, you press one of the two buttons on the front. You have a blue button with a plus sign and a green button with the OK sign. Hold the, the uh, green uh, button down for three seconds and let it count three, two, one. And then when it does that, you can release. The unit will turn itself on and go through a series of self-tests. Also standard in the XAM 2000 is the data logging capability. We can data log up to 1,000 hours of information. Um, the XAM 5000 has all the same features with the exception that uh, we can add a fifth sensor there. And uh, the fifth sensor can be anything from a regular uh, ammonia sensor all the way up to something exotic like the uh, phosphine sensor. 